Let's talk about how to avoid burning bridges in your career. First of all, there are two principles that I coach everybody by, which is you are a business of one and every job is temporary. That means you always have to be strategic and look out for yourself. And there are going to come times where, yes, you're going to make an employer unhappy with your decision. So how can you minimize the impact of that, right? Because essentially what you're doing is you're firing a customer, right? You're the service provider and they're paying you. You're firing a customer. So you're trying to minimize the fallout from that. So one of the things that I always suggest is try to soften the blow as much as you can by providing ways to make your transition out of the company as seamless as possible. So what are some ways we can do that? Giving them more time, right? So normally we give two weeks notice. Offer three weeks or a month if you can. See if your new employer will let you have more transition time. Two, talk about setting up an entire plan to transition and making yourself available even after you've left for phone calls or emails or whatever it takes if people have any questions, right? And third, really compliment them sincerely about what you love about them. Explain this is just too good of an offer to pass up. You know, say, I'm probably going to regret this. I really want to find a way to stay in touch with you. You know, show that sincerity and recognize them for the good traits about them, all right? And that's all you can do. And yes, they might still be a little salty about the whole thing, but c'est la vie. That's life. You've got to do what's right for you. Why? Because you're a business of one and every job is temporary. If they had to switch gears and fire you tomorrow, they could and they would in order to protect their business. And so we don't need to get like emotional about it. We just stay objective and do what we can. So those would be my tips to do this. It doesn't always work, but definitely give it a try. Thank you for asking this. It means already you're a special kind of person that wants to, you know, figure out how to keep these relationships going. And that alone will carry a lot of weight, I'm, I promise you. Folks, I love the hard questions. We keep them coming, please? Like and follow me here because I always check to see if you're following me. Post your questions. Let me do what I can to help you. I've been doing this for 20 years. I'm on this app trying to answer your career and job search questions as much as I can. And please don't forget, if you're enjoying this advice, I got a ton more free resources linked to my bio. My disruptive job search checklist, my resume, LinkedIn boot camp, my career quizzes, so much good stuff, totally free linked in my bio to help you as well. All right. You've got this. Good luck. Go get them.